everybody. Um, this might be a little bit of a rough stream here. My other monitor, I think, is officially kaput. So I have to run on both screens, that's why I'm windowed here. Usually I wouldn't do that, but things happen. And when the stores are closed, it's hard to get anything. got a lot of cars in this, so we're probably going to see some mayhem. Hopefully I can put together a decent qualifying run and start up front. And avoid Pit line speed mess. limit is 50 miles per hour. There's traffic approaching, watch your mirrors. May actually get to see um, some pretty awesome wrecks. You know, even if we do, we'll get Illegal back out just and done a run and have some fun. Because even if you end up two laps down, you might still get a top three finish. I have run one of these races before. The track uh, temperature is increasing. It's now 104 Fahrenheit. I believe I actually saw 22 cars all crash at the same time. Let's see, we are running 25 cars in this. Ooh. Right, let's just get it going here. Let's see what happens. It takes it's clear. All right, Eric, we've got two laps. Let's get this done. Keep some RPMs. V11, that was a 24.55. used to being able to look at my second monitor, but don't have that right now. Let's see, sitting in eighth. Make that ninth. It looks like a lot, but seven one hundredths of a second is not much. That's how closely packed we all are. Are yet to qualify. Come down to P ten.
did a race yesterday. I was running about the same spot and thought I avoided a wreck, but somehow I ended up taking damage on the right rear. Going back and watching the video, I actually didn't even get hit. And I think I still ended up in fifth place. So that's what it is. Even if you get caught up, might as well run. Just have some fun. It is an unranked race, so why not? Nestle quick car uh, up and to the right. I've run that one before with the quick bunny. ago I ran and the car in front of me brake checked up here and ended up three cars got stacked up behind me. I almost ended up in the wall trying to miss him. And then on green he didn't go and tried to go around the outside and got spun out and collected another car. So this can be a wild track and you never know what you're gonna see. Another interesting track to run on in these cars in the series is the Legacy Phoenix. Quick crashing, guys! May have got a touch close, but... Question is, can I get through turn one? Floor it, green, green, green. Outside. Still there, still there. Outside clear. I have to go back and look at that replay. And yeah, let's not send it three wide into turn one again. I did get clipped, I got a 4x, but I'm not really sure what happened. Hopefully it doesn't affect my speed too much. Oh, they are going wide. I think I am 
going to be a tick slow here, unfortunately. Outside, outside. They're up top. see what happened. That was all smoke and I could not see a thing. Fuck you! Literally, fuck you! If you fucking wreck, stay in the wall! We are gonna just disable that. I apologize for language. Sorry, man. Oh yeah, they went three wide going in and clip down. Let's see, how far down am I already? 19th, two laps down. This upcoming season will more than likely be running a lot of C races and probably avoiding some of this. Surely more cars are going to crash, so we're 19th. Let's see where we end up. This could be quite hilarious. And I have turned off radio chatter so we don't have to hear anything. spots already. Not all races like this, there's just a combination of everybody because it's the kind of off week. It's the last week of the season, so there's very limited racing available. 14th. Okay, Eric. You're in the sky. The gap's now. P13 is racing P2. Pretty tough. The gap in front is increasing. It's now 155. That lap was up 24 and 15. That's your best lap in the session. I will uh, apologize again if anything comes across. Some people get really worked up over a video game. B12, that lap was at 24.11. I said, I've already moved up seven spots since coming back out on track.
position. You've just done a 24.10. Okay, Eric, your lap times are pretty consistent. It's gonna be kind of fun to watch what happens up here. I want to race for position, but I also don't want to make it rough on P2. The lap time was 24.11. I'd hate to take that away from somebody. The gap in front is now 0 0.80. We are catching cars, though. That's the thing, if you get wrecked, just go back out there, especially in the lower dash, because you're going to see cars crash. And I'll be a couple laps down, still second. Top, top 10. Top 10. Catch on to my draft here. That was a twenty-four point three five. Left. That lap was at 24.28. Yeah, it's probably not worth it. Two laps to go. The gap in front has increased. It's now about 1.07. Even if we passed, it would be hard to catch, so we're just going to chill. White flag, one more lap. That lap was at 24.51. See the start here. We're going three wide. I'm trying to stay out of business there.
probably should have been a little smarter there, but you know what? Things happen. Still ended up in the top eight there. So we'll call it good. Alright, thank you all for checking out. We'll see you soon.